Thank you, Mr. Chairman. Uh, Senate Bill 597 has to do with uh, having full information available to you when you're in the polling place, and a lot of that information is available for many of us these days on our cell phones. And I don't know how many of you uh, saw it this past election cycle, but our Secretary of State, Secretary Hargett, actually created an app that you can download, and I did this, and it was extremely helpful. Uh, You type in your your name and address, and it gives you all the different candidates who are on your ballot. And so that way you can know uh, which races you'll be voting in before you get into the voting booth. And it was extremely helpful helpful for me to make up my mind as to, uh, to whom I wanted to vote for in each of those races. However, there are some county election commissions uh, that prohibit cell phones and cell phone usage inside the polling places, and I think uh, probably for good reason. It can be disruptive if you're talking on the phone, or uh, potentially if you took pictures of uh, things that were going on there, you could, you could uh, cause a problem with confidential, with revealing confidential information in there. So that's why I put forward before you Senate Bill 597 which simply says that a county election uh, commission uh, uh, shall not prohibit a voter from using that mobile electronic uh, device at the polling place. However, they may require you to silence your phone, and they also, um, you also sh- uh, shall be prohibited from taking pictures or recording video. So uh, with that, I would, I would uh, hope for and appreciate a motion on the bill. A uh, motion on the bill and with a second. Uh, do we have any questions for the sponsors? Uh, uh, Senator Green. Thanks, Mr. Chairman. Uh, Senator Kelsey, just real quick, I mean, is are these voting machines at all susceptible to some kind of hacking if the phone gets, like, next to the machine or something like that through Bluetooth or anything like that, or are we pretty confident that can't happen? I have no idea. Uh, I'll respond to that. Uh, having having uh, formerly worked as chairman of this committee and, and worked very closely with HAVA and all the other machines that have come in over the years in the HAVA funds, those machines, uh, to my knowledge right now, can't, can't be transmitted between the cell phone, and, and uh, I think they're fairly secure. It's my knowledge. Uh, I'm not sure if anybody here is from a, a state election coordinator, but uh, I, I feel fairly confident in that statement. If we'll Thank just, you. Without going into recess... The state election coordinator is here, uh, and he is nodding agreement to your statement, and we'll just let that be in the record. Uh, yeah. Do we have other questions for the sponsor? Now, help me clarify this, uh, Mr. Chairman. Um, this bill will, this bill would pro- would prohibit essentially talking on the telephone. You still might. It does not prohibit using a telephone for an information piece because. I may carry the sample ballot with me on my phone. It does not prohibit that type of activity, only uh, disruptive activity like talking. That's correct. All right. Any other questions? Well, if there's no objection, we'll call the roll.